what is going on we are back again with more keto more more and more keto legends of a keto b strike we got our three figures and our dummy this time we got a joystick we are going a keto crazy in here so now we got our joystick we got our epic king gokong we got our legendary dragon fang night blade even though he doesn't have a blade we got our ultra rare dragon claw chucks and we have a dummy this time so I made a beat up on. I am excited for this. More and more Aikido. I'm loving these figures. Let us get into this. Let's get this open. Okay, so something very important. So this is actually my second set. Uh, the first one I gave to my nephew and uh, Dragon Claw Chucks actually broke when he was taking out the package and he wasn't being rough uh, taking it out. I even had trouble taking uh, this one out and this one. So be careful when you're taking them out. So here's the joystick, uh, very similar to the beast. It is beast strike, by the way. Uh, just a little bit different. It has like a little claw there, gripping the joy the joystick. And uh, has both the numbers. So you just set your power level and you can set your your health, you play by the rules. Uh, but yeah, let's compare it to the other one. So I have uh, one of my favorites here. Got uh, Stink King here, one of my favorites. Exactly the same as that. Joysticks are pretty good though. If you get a chance, get some joysticks, get them online, or just uh, find them in store. Get you a nice set like this. But yeah, so exactly the same. Um, just want to do a quick one on this one. Uh, maybe let's do a review. Maybe I'll show you why my nephew was beating me. That's, I want to definitely try this uh, Dragon Claw Chucks too. Okay, so let's do a demonstration. I'm going to put uh, King Gokong in my dominant hand, my right hand. And I will do Night Blade. We'll call him Night Blade in my left. Let's go. Ready, go. Oh my goodness, that's rare. I did some test runs before and that didn't happen before. Let's go. Oh my god, double split strike. Oh, let's go. Okay, there you go. One more. <laughs> I'm having too much fun doing this. Let's do one more. Wow, wow, there you have it. Okay, so let's try uh, Nightblade versus uh, Dragon Call Chucks. Okay, so as I was prepping uh, Dragon Call Chucks for this battle, you could just feel the weight, uh, placing them in the controller, and you could just you could feel that weight, and you just know that's that's a lot of power. No, no wonder it's an eight and four. Uh, and then doing a couple of test swings. I actually uh, scratched my finger up, uh, so you got to be careful with this one. This one's a dangerous one. But anyway, let's get into it. All right, got him in my dominant hand. Let's go. Oh, wow, this is going to be a long one. Whoa, wow. Okay, so the only reason why that was a double split strike is because I moved in closer with uh, Nightblade. Always forget his name, Nightblade. But once again, with uh, with these Chucks figures, you have to get some distance uh, to get you a split strike. Uh, that was intense. I banged on my fingers a bit, uh, but I'm not going to do another one because uh, that might take long. And just know with your Chucks, you need distance. For this one, he's like a boxer. You got to get in close, get you a knockout. Uh, but yeah, let's go ahead and finish, set him up and... Let's go ahead and just get this dummy real quick. All right, so this is the dummy. I forgot what character this is, but it's something fun. If uh, you have no one, if you have this, you have no one to play with. Dummies come in handy. But let's get everybody there and let's uh, end this video. Okay, success. So if you're worried about uh, breaking your figure, uh, here's what you do. So here's the plastic that came in. I went ahead and, and I bent all the plastic that surrounds each figure 
and to su successfully pull them out. <laughs> so go ahead and just bend all that, tear it up. You can't even see which figure which in uh, e uh, each slot was. Uh, that's how you're going to have to bend it up uh, to get them out successful. But anyway, get that out of here. So these characters look great. Now, because my nephew uh, broke his, I'm going to give him this Dragon Claw Chucks. But, man, he looks great. And he's an 8 and 4. We couldn't experience the 8 and 4 because he broke uh, 6. 1 and 6 in the back. Oh, man, he looks great. Oh, man, I know how powerful this one got to be. Got to be powerful. But, we did play. And we played with uh, this one and this one. And this one is, oh man, he beat me so bad every time. I couldn't, I couldn't get a win. I even tried a Jungle Heart and uh, Tail Whip, the original Tail Whip, and other big stinky. I, I could not win. He, he just kept getting me with this. I'm so happy he was uh, excited to play with these. Uh, but yeah, so I'm missing something. I'm missing the joystick. Let's get the joystick. Okay, so we are going to wrap it up. Ah, had a lot of fun with this one. But, oh, I forgot to mention. So, uh, Nightblade is a 6 and 4. King Gokong is a 6 and 4 as well. But, big difference. Big difference. Uh, this is a puncher. You get your, get a chance to get a puncher and you're going to have a good time. A lot of wins. Uh, but, yeah. And we got our 8 and 4. Man. Beautiful. Anyway. So let's go ahead and wrap it up. That is it. Uh, thank you guys for watching. If you're interested in these, these Aikido figures, I'm, I'm definitely enjoying these. Very fun to play with. Kids love it. And uh, go on and go on and hit that subscribe button. I really appreciate it. Let's keep growing this channel. We got some more toys coming out. We'll get into other figures as well. But thank you guys for watching as always. And keep it locked if you're interested in these toy reviews.